Hello there everyone and thank you for joining me here at the start of a new campaign in Old World Blues, the A to Z series in which we're playing as Las Granjas, um, a nation that we're destined to go to war with the Legion. Um, regardless, I'm your host, Mr. Milk Lover, and right now we're fighting the Sinaloa Cartel um, in 2278. I made a Tlalocan explode early on in the beginning, so um, just so we need extra territory down here so that we can uh, make ourselves m more ready for the war against Khazar, because the war against Khazar is going to what we call suck really badly. And, uh, yeah, it's something we pretty much just have to do, uh, and do okay. Now, there may come a time, and probably very soon in this episode, where, uh, Kaiser's Legion is going to try to beat the crap out of us. Like I said, it's going to happen probably very, very soon, so, we'll see. But we're led by who? Zoro de Chihuahua. The people of Chihuahua Desert are a hardy folk. They grow their crops on lands where naturally only cactuses prevail. They battle the sun and the drought and still emerge victorious because they are not only surviving, but creating life. The wastelanders call this region the breadbasket of Mexico for a reason. But there are more enemies here besides weather and the wildlife. The ever expanding flawed democracy to the east would be happy if we would join their state. Cartels to the south and the scourge of the wasteland, the legion to the north. The Granjero are sturdy but cannot fight against such enemies as they come with brute force. Dark schemes and honeyed words, the fox at Chihuahua swore they would protect this piece of land against everything, even if the odds looked like they found themselves cornered. The fox itself is a mystery, as no one saw their face before, and they just appeared one day and took the mantle. Are they disgraced luchadors who lost the mask? A former cartel thug now hiding their true identity to save their hide, or, in the same manner, a legion slave who cannot return to Arizona. Nobody knows for sure. One thing is for certain, however. They're here, and they're here to stay. So, we'll see what happens. I might have to do some funky stuff, because there's no way we can take on the legion. So, yeah. Also, I guess, is the pot that's taking out into the soul? That's fine. Whatever. And So, we're led by the people, people. And so, we're going to go with probably the people. Support the people. So, you're going like, to read by them. Please go ahead. As we're going to do our best as we can, trying to fight over the waterways, the desert, and see what we can do. Once this, these guys are done, we'll be we'll be golden. So, oh, the Lannis went to war with them, which is good. Recon kits. Um, anything else here? Um, I guess we'll get better refined mixtures. Let's show you what we're working with. We need more manpower. Um, the, we have 18 combo, which is not bad. Chems, demo teams, and we got Spec Ops Divisions, 20 combo with anti tank, chems, uh, and demo teams as well. It's not bad. Um, we just gotta make sure we spread out and take these guys out as fast as we possibly can. So, these divisions up here will be the best. Ooh, casualties. We've lost about 1700 versus their 9000, so, all in all, that's not bad. Uh, I guess Ejcito is at war with them as well, which is fine. You know, whatever. Come on, come on, come on, finish them off, finish them off, finish them off. Once these guys are dead, it, it's go time. So, hurry up. Oop, oop, oop. Beep, beep. Nice, there you go. We do have quite a few divisions, don't we? Hmm. That's pretty nice. Go, 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 go. Where are you guys at? You know what, you're gonna go to. Keep these guys in place, go there. And you're just gonna, like, VP snap if you possibly can. We're not really, really VP snapping, but, you know, like I said, we're doing what we can. Nice. Rika and Arroyo. Um, yeah, that would be bad. You know what? We're using them anyway for now. Desert it up. Oh. So, I want to take this territory so at least we have some place we can core. Uh, go here. Around here. Um, as we support the people. Uh, unlimited democracy. Well, it did say we were a democracy. So, we're also breadbasket. Oh no, we were not a democracy. It's democracy to the east of us, so the Rio pact, which they already died. Huh. Well, we are democracy. The Las Garantes is the last remnant of democracy in Mexico, or so they say. They refused Tlaloc's protection or dream of reclaiming Mexico for themselves, but with an Arizona monster of the north, they may regret not accepting protection from a god. So we can get people's militia. That would be bad. You get more recruitable population and three more divisions. A constitutional monarchy? No, that makes no sense for us. A constitutional republic? Or an unlimited democracy? Expanding rights. And then we... People. I kind of like people's militia because we need those divisions. And we need that population. We need extra population. You know what? Hmm. I'll we'll do some funky stuff anyways. We can have an early legions and see our war. Community full of experienced people, and this common experience will also move together forward. 
Four together? Yeah, why not? Yeah, help them out. Help them out. If I help them out, I'm gonna just kill them all. Nice. Good. Go in if you can. Nice. That's good at least. Yeah, we definitely need more manpower though. Boop. That'd be nice. Focus fire is good. And population. So we're using overall blues. Overall blues tech expanded. Uh, oh, or tech expansion. Overall blues generic decisions reworked. Um, Old World Blues Radio, Stage Manager Tool Mod. I think that might be it that we're using. I can't remember off the top of my head. Oh, they're all fighting these guys. I'm just worried that Henta del Sol will join Kaiser's Legion. There's no way we can defend against that. If we're like this, we have one gigantic border, which is going to suck. And there's a couple waterways, which we should be able to defend. We do have quite a few divisions, but we need to improve them. Um, yeah, I guess we'll have to really wait and see. Well, this isn't ideal. Um... So basically, I forced the Legion to go to war with the Sorrows, or not Sorrows, but Sleepers. And I also forced them to go to war with the Second Second Mexican Empire, who's done very well. We'll actually want to kill us too. Uh, but they've been fighting over here each with each other, because the Second Second Mexican Empire took over Henta del Sol. So we're pushing in in the front. Um, they did not guard their borders correctly, and then they declared war upon us, which is fine with me. Um, but uh, yeah, this has turned into a giant mess. But what else do you expect, you know? At this point, I just want one solid front line if we possibly can have one. Uh, that'd be very nice. That'd be very helpful. So, and we're almost doing with actually our focus group, which is actually pretty nice too. So, we will see in just a little bit. I mean, our main focus will be being on defense. That is by far the most important thing for us. Uh, I'm gonna separate you guys here first. You guys hold, because at this point, you guys can just be one solid front line. Um, I wish it didn't come into like this, but we're here to defend for the most part. That's really what I want to do. Why don't you just hold, 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 hold the line. Now, we'll balance it out. Don't get me wrong. Um, I don't want uh, us, or really, I don't want the second, second Mexican Empire to do very, 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 very well. Um, instead, I'd rather us hold out. Oh, God. And our ships are dead. And now we have no navy. What do you expect? Help us hold out, whatnot. Hopefully, do okay. I mean, our divisions are decent. Not gonna lie. They are decent overall. We can't win everywhere and everything, but this is pretty much where we're at. We'll, we'll mess around with this whole bunch. Uh, Let's take a look at casualties first. We've lost 200 some. 900, 800. Ooh, that's a lot. Kaiser's Legion has lost a lot. I mean, the NCR is dead. They're busy killing each other. Um, Redding is fighting the MMA war. Oh, these guys over here. Ooh. Tough one in your way. Well then. So things are a giant mess. Um, which is not ideal. It is what it is. It's not great. So, yeah. But like I said, we'll balance things out quite a bit to make sure things are okay and whatnot. Um, but that's what we want. We want to be okay. We do a lot of things, more territories and whatnot over here down in the south. Um, that's why we also took over the Sinaloa Cocktail so we can get more population and whatnot. Because, you know, we're struggling. Oh, I'm thinking metal. You don't worry about this. Please go ahead. Robots are good at killing people. Let's make them better at it. Human hands are not enough. Maybe more creative AI could help. I like that one. Um, so we'll be doing as much as we can around here, too. We can get a new research department as well. And this research slot would be kind of beneficial, so we might as well do that. I'd say that's pretty good overall. Um, but yeah, well, so I'm going to spend a lot more time with this off screen because Las Granjas, I mean, you're de destined. Truth be told, we should have already died. Um, Kaiser's Legion should have taken the focus earlier about them killing us, but it is what it is. And honestly, I think I have to leave it there just because I have to spend more time with this off screen. And, you know, I don't have a ton of time. So. Um, regardless, the NCR, or at least the California, whoever's going to win here, should finish off the war. The Legion should have a little bit of a tussle with us, and we're going to struggle a lot here anyways. But, hey, I know this has been a very short episode, but if you enjoyed it regardless, please consider leaving a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you tomorrow. As we'll figure out where we're up next with Las Granjas, running out of manpower, and, you know, pouring more states. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.